Well, what integrity means is being able to conduct myself and my activities, you know, um, in ways that, you know, uphold the uh, professional ethics of the things I do. It also means uh, being able to uphold the public's best interests in all of the things I do, both in my public life and in my private life. I see him like one of the outstanding person in Liberia that can make a great change in this nation. And I see him like, like a different person, not in a bar, in a bar way, but someone who we Liberians should listen to, should follow, to go according to him his way of thinking and his way of doing things. He's a integrated person and he always wish for the best. Well, I think um, this recognition stems from the fact that, you know, um, from the time I've known myself, you know, in my, in my much early years, you know, I've always upheld to Help myself to integrity tenants. You know, I remember for many, many years I was teaching assistant to at the University of Liberia. In those years, when you know uh, the situation in the country was not so good as a result of the war, we managed to preserve, you know, um, our integrity. We made sure that we didn't do the kinds of things that others were doing in terms of compromising issues with grades you know, and other things. We refrained from doing those things. We were attending classes regularly, every day. Um, I actually think that Mr. Jana is, sometimes I jokingly say he's a man with a computer brain because um, when a computer, if you plug this, the computer has to do it that way. So the computer is already programmed. He doesn't bend his rules, he doesn't, you know, try to get into the system and manipulate things. No, he doesn't do it, he doesn't, he doesn't do that. For him, he believes in the way things should be done. And at the end of the day, it's just for the good of everybody. Because, and I think we actually need more people like him in the government. Sometimes I jokingly say to people, we need to photocopy him. What I would like to tell the public is that, and, and, and to my contemporaries in government in particular, is that look, we have a small country. We are endowed with a lot of resources. If we can just all commit that we will do the right thing for our country, we can be able to turn this country around into a prosperous country.